It's Monday morning, and I'm making breakfast. I went to the gym today and did legs. But I think I overdid it, because I almost passed out and threw up. It's all right, though. I'll try again this week. I'm doing laundry this morning. I have a set of shirts that I really like wearing. So I wash them all together and I use wool light instead of Tide. I try to take care of them so they last me a while. I think that's a good habit to have. To learn to take care of your things. I never put these in the dryer. Instead, I just hang dry them. And they still look like new. So I guess it's paying off. I got a letter in the mail. This is the first Halloween card I've gotten. It's from my girlfriend. She tells me that next year we'll get to spend Halloween together. She's moving to Boston next summer. Since today's Monday, I'm meal prepping for the week. I put rice to boil for 45 minutes. And while that's finishing, I cook chicken. I do this so often that I have a system. I cook chicken on the stovetop for five minutes on one side and three minutes the other. Then I put the chicken in the oven for half an hour. And if I do this right, then the chicken and rice are finished cooking at the same time. And I like this system. It's efficient. This food lasts me four days. I eat it with Chick-fil-A sauce. It tastes pretty good. Now I'm getting ready to go to campus. I put on a polo and my favorite sweater. And I'm packing a roast beef sandwich for dinner. I need some new vans. These are pretty dirty. Maybe it's because I'm always walking through water. This is my favorite view of Boston. And now we're at Harvard Square. I'm going to the coop to pick up a postcard. The Coop is the official Harvard bookstore. It's really nice inside. I like this JFK postcard. He was actually a student here. I think I'll get it. I like bookstores. When I used to walk into bookstores, I would wish that I could read every book inside. It sounded exciting to know a little bit about everything. You could talk to anybody about anything. And you'd have the information to do anything you ever wanted. You'd be unstoppable. I guess that's why I like the idea. I owe some kid money, so I have to stop by the bank. A while back, we all made a hot pot. And this kid covered the cost, and he told me not to worry about it. But when I was growing up, my mom always taught me to pay people back when they did you a favor. So I have to pay him back even if he tells me not to. That's what I'm going to teach my kids too, because respect is more valuable than a little bit of money. I'm at the library now to get some work done. It's a nice area. It's very quiet. I've been working on this presentation for a long time, about three months. And pretty soon it's going to pay off. Just a little bit more and I'll reach the end. And after I'm done, I can focus on research. Now I'm going to the physics department to catch a talk. These talks happen every Monday, and they're a big deal in our department. Today's speaker is currently a postdoc at Harvard, but she's actually about to become a professor here. It's really exciting. You get to watch somebody's career take off. One thing they can do in their experiment is animate Super Mario using atoms. Seems like a lot of fun. Today was an all right day. Now it's Tuesday and I'm doing laundry again. I'm just washing some cooking towels. I cook a lot so they're pretty dirty. I have a lot to do this morning, so I have to get started. I'm gonna send out this postcard to my girlfriend. I hope she likes it. It's funny because I have some JFK stamps to go with the card. Now I gotta get ready to go to the post office. My closet is really organized. On the right, I have all the clothes I really like. 
Then there's the shirts I sort of like. And then some t-shirts. Then pants in the middle. And then dress shirts and sweaters. Today I'm wearing one of the shirts I really like. Now we're going to send Johnny off. There's a post office around the corner. It's a nice walk with all the leaves. I can't wait for her to see it. I came back just in time for a seminar. This one's really interesting, so I'm taking some notes. And I'm actually learning a lot, even if it is technical. I'm eating some oatmeal before going to campus. I've been trying to gain weight recently, and I figured I'd start by eating more oatmeal. I love these trees, but they only look like this for about a week, and after that the leaves fall off. So I try to enjoy it while I can. It's a good reminder to look up every now and then. Today in lecture we had a demo. It was kind of dangerous, but it was pretty cool. And now I'm getting ready for section. I like this room. It's really big. We had a group meeting today, and afterwards we all went to get dinner. It's this place called Mulan. I like coming to these dinners. It's like one big family. And we get to try about 10 different plates. It's really good. Now I'm walking through MIT to get back home. It's really nice at night. And finally, we're back. Now it's morning again, and I'm doing more laundry. This time it's towels. All of my towels are color coordinated. They last me about two weeks. I try to be organized, but there's still a few things in my life that I haven't gotten down. I've been spending so much time on this presentation that it takes away time from research. So I need to time manage better. But I want to time manage everything. I don't want to leave anything behind. I want to use every minute I can to improve my life the best I can. And today something snapped in me. Today I took care of all the things I've been leaving behind. Like my apartment. I've been wanting to clean my bathtub for months. But I always tell myself I'll do it the next time and the next time. And it never gets done. So today I'm going to do it. Because this bathtub represents my life right now. It's neglected because I haven't put the work in yet. But that's something I can easily fix. So why not fix it? It feels pretty good to do what needs to be done. I also have to replace my shower curtains. So today I'm finally buying them. It feels good. I'm also doing dishes today. I want everything to be clean. And I'm also meal prepping today with ground beef. Should last me three days. Today I'm eating sloppy joes. It's a little different. It feels good to change things up. It's the weekend and I'm doing groceries. I came to stop and shop. I came just to buy vegetables. I eat a lot of fruit, but I never eat enough vegetables. This is another thing I want to fix in my life. I want to be healthy. This week I've been trying to fix every problem I have. And today's not even about groceries. Everything I'm buying represents a piece of my lifestyle I've been missing. Something to clean up my life. To fix it. To help me grow and develop. Like protein. And chicken. Everything's finally going to be in order. And I'm happy with that.